Hi, this is Sunil Manji, Senior Principal Solution Architect Elastic. I'll be doing a rapid demonstration on how to instrument the Elastic Java Elastic APM agent with the Spring Boot application that's interfacing with IBM MQ over JMS. It's quite simple. I've leveraged a lot of the assets that are already out there, but let's start with the end state first, right? What does it look like if we do have it instrumented? So I'll go into observability. I have an application up and running already. So let's go into services and it does show up. My application is IBM MQ test app. And I can go in here. I can actually look at the transactions, um, look at the traces. So a ton of information here. Uh, so this is wired up correctly, right? So how did I do this? How did I get to this end state? So first, there's two things I really needed. I, one, I wanted um, a UI to be able to interface with IBM MQ. And second, uh, I needed IBM MQ, which I hosted um, within a Docker instance. So if you go to my GitHub page, a lot of this, it's all there for you. It's in Sunil Man, Spring Boot, IBM MQ, Elastic APM. It tells you all the information you need to get this uh, type of demo up and running. Just to give them credit, I did for the UI um, that I'm using, and let's go to the UI now, and let's, let's take a look at how it, how it looks. So I'm gonna go ahead and interface with it. And I'm gonna say, today is a great day. And I'll send that one more time, we'll receive it. Okay, so it is working. It was able to send the message and receive the message. So all is working well. So where did, it, where did I get the UI? Um, I received the UI from, excuse me for bouncing around. I go to IBM messaging here and to MQ uh, patterns, dev patterns. And from here, I use the Spring Boot MVC. So as long as you pull that repo, you build the application, you're good to go and you'll have that UI. So that's one part of it, but you also need the IBM MQ, right? And I use uh, Docker. And from here, how I got that up and running is I use the IBM MQ development in a container. It worked well. And I was able to wire that up together. Instructions on how to set up the queues and the names, all that's in the repo. That's the end of the demonstration. So what did I do today? I just wanted to rapidly show how uh, Elastic APM can interact or instru be instrumented with an application that's, within Spring, uh, that's built on Spring Boot and interfacing or interacting with IBM MQ over JMS. Thanks for watching.